Hello YouTube and welcome to a short edition of Lori's Thrifty Kitchen Pantry. If you're new, welcome. I'm so glad that you're here with me today. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. And happy Thanksgiving to everyone. So I just wanted to show you a quick project that, well, it wasn't a quick project. It was an impromptu project that I did last night because I didn't have any room in my refrigerator to put my cooked turkey. So I went ahead and pressure canned it. I was going to videotape it, but y'all, it, it was going on 11 o'clock when I started this and I just wanted to get the meat in the jars and in the canner. It, it does take a while to set things up to videotape and then to go back and edit and get everything up. So I just got it in the jars and got it in the canner. So let me turn you around and show you my beautiful jars of canned turkey. And here we are. We have five jars of beautifully sealed turkey using my four jars lids i have four jars of turkey and three jars of beautiful concentrated turkey broth that i can add water or extra broth to to thin it out some and that will go a long way but look at the color in that turkey from those spices that we put in there it looks absolutely amazing. I'm so excited to have that on my shelf. And this was the other project I was working on. This is that great big bag of peppers that I had gotten from the food pantry last week. They are all dehydrated. And I have an oxygen absorber in there just to make sure that they all stay dry. But look how pretty that jar looks. And I'll be able to throw those peppers into anything. I can grind it up and use it as a powder to thicken things with. And it's just going to be great having that on my shelf. So this is that whole great big huge bag of, of peppers that I have from the food pantry. So yeah, this is just a, sh a short video. I forgot to put the vinegar in my water last night because y'all, it was so late when I did this. But I washed my jars off anyway, so the white that's on the jars will come off when I wash them. But yeah, all of my jars sealed. And this makes three projects so far with the four jars canning lids. I've had a full canner each time and each jar has sealed so I am really happy with those lids. I know they are having a Black Friday sale. The lids are marked down to well they're 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 marked down a lot and I know there's a few channels out there um half i think it's half acre homestead um mrs wolfie up in canada has a link on her website where you can get another 10 percent off besides the black friday sale prices i think um sutton's sutton days has a usually has a link in her videos where you can get get some off that that's just two of them that I can think of right off the top of my head because y'all I'm I'm exhausted I still have a lot to get done I didn't get to my three bean salad I'm actually okay with not doing that right now because I got a lot of ground beef and chicken that was on sale yesterday for $1.99 a pound I need to get that pressure canned um, so, so I'm, I'm actually okay with, with putting off doing that until I get my other proteins canned up. So I'm going to get done what I can get done today and I'll videotape what I can, what I can to show you guys what I'm working on. I, there will be just a short live stream tonight just to 
touch base with all of you and and to wish y'all a, a happy Thanksgiving. So not, not a long life, just, just a short one. So I will see you all hopefully later this evening. It will be at 7 p.m. Uh, Eastern U.S. time. And hopefully I'll, I'll see you then. If not, I'll see you all on the next video. Bye.